Hello and welcome back to Mega Man Battle Network! I really like saying that. <laughs> Last time our school got taken over by a terrorist. So, you know, we should do something about that. Because there's no one who could possibly do a better job of solving this problem than a five-year-old. Sorry, no, fifth grader, I meant. We're not five, that would be ridiculous. We're like nine. Um. Yeah. We got money, which will come in handy. We do need to buy up all those upgrades after all. Uh, let's see. I'm thinking shotgun here. Oh, I got hit. Yeah, it does move, too. Oh. I forgot about that. I forgot about that. Um, right, if you can just do that, please, thank you. It has a wide area attack. If we use the chip, it won't do that, incidentally. But this one has an attack like that. Uh, oh, hey! Well, that's kind of convenient. Right, I think the cannon will do here. Yeah, I got hit. Just a crappy met guard for me. It's okay, we'll have something to do with our waste chips later in the game. So, even, gar even having tons of garbage chips, like met guard, is not totally worthless. Which is good, because we are going to have a lot of- a bloody lot of shockwaves and met guards. Um, by the time we're through. This door is passcode protected. Door will not open without proper authorization. Passcode hint. Number of chairs in 5A. Well, it's either 9 or 12. Mm -hmm. 9 it is. Unless there's like something on the side. Nope. It is nine! I'm fairly sure, yes. Okay, oh hey, the door to the classroom unlocked. Well, that's convenient. And this must be... Wait, aren't we in... Yeah, this must be 5B. Feel the power of sword! Quickly now, before it starts moving. The virus that started the re-education program. Why did most of the programs around here? But you're not a program, you're a Navi. You're a lame Navi, but you're a Navi. Uh, no offense. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Uh... Which way do I want to... this way. Oh, let's see how you like some sword, you jumping bastards! Apparently you like it well enough. Hmm, and... Well, cannon won't quite finish you off, but... It'll, 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 uh, it'll suffice. Like so! Ha! Okay, uh, we got high cannon, I, which is a cannon that hits for more, plus also obviously the code is different. Oh hey, this looks like a good time to show off roll. Yeah, let's, well, actually, roll would be most effective against the one in the back, so I should try to clear out the Metars first. Mm 
Oh, careful. So, something worth mentioning is about the charge thing. The, now, in theory, the charge attack is really useful in this game. Uh, in practice, however, well, in practice, it's still really useful. Uh, I am totally in the habit of not using it, though. Uh, because... When I... Because when I played this game as a child, uh, I played it against my friend a lot. And my friend was, like, insanely good at using counterattacks. Uh, ref putting up a shield to block an attack, then reflect it back at me. Uh, which could take different forms depending on which iteration of Mega Man Battle Network we were playing. But the point is, he was really, really good at it. So, the way I found to get around that was basically to just max out the speed of my buster instead and spam the crap out of it. Because he was really, really good at blocking individual attacks, but less so when there was a whole lot of small ones. Oh? Okay. Oh. If I have to, I guess. Oh hey, it's like a ghost. So yeah, that's the story of why I am bad at Mega Man. Well, no, that's the story of why I sh should be better at Mega Man. Uh, but also, why... Okay, um, Cannon is too slow. You're annoying! Hmm. Ha! Ah, dead. But also really annoying. Um... I honestly don't remember what that does. I don't think it's very good. It might be. Uh, I think it... Yeah, I honestly don't remember. Library data lock for data preservation. Passcode required for entry. Hint, number of volumes of history of the world. Uh, I don't believe this number changes, but you can't exactly look it up ahead of time now, can you? Mm-hmm. Uh, that's probably not good. You cannot- Oh, so you actually can't stand up. Well, I'm glad- I'm glad that was- that was made clear. I can go in here. Yep. Seems like it. Uh... Okay. Yeah, I mean, that's a little bit meta, but sure. It's true. I wonder indeed. Group 3 has cleaning duty. You can learn about ants with an ant farm. Put in books near the window, it makes the covers fade. That's actually true. If you leave, um, if you leave paper out in the sun too long, the ink on it will start to, uh, be bleached by the sunlight. Oh, hey! We found a spreader. Uh, okay then. Uh, what? You people are terrible. Being brainwashed so quickly. I guess the door downstairs has been locked as well. Hmm. Okay then. Uh, they were here, right? 30. Oh, uh, nope! That's wrong. There we go. Okie dokie. Uh, wait, that was presumably the door to the library, but I'm already in the library. Um, okay, let's, let's see if I was full of shit about this. I'm pretty sure I was not, but... You know, I can hope. 
I was totally not full of shit about it. Or rather, I totally was full of shit about it. Score! It's still better than a mini bomb. Uh... I just miss- I just confused it with a different chip, evidently. This door is password protected. Door will not open without proper authorization. Passcode hint. None. Okay, as I recall... Passcode too low, second digit, verification failure. Uh, yes. Password too low, first digit, verification failure. Oh wait, I went the wrong direction. Is it 55? It's 55. Okay, well, I managed to bungle my way into that, but... Really, really I should, probably shouldn't have been able to solve that because I was doing it wrong. Normally, you can get to the Teacher's Lounge server just by going up and to the right. But now, there are several breaks in the network! Oh no! I assume you mean up and to the left, though. Because, I mean, seriously, come on, dude. Come on. Oh, well, this is new. Uh... What's over here? Okay. That's another door. I guess we'll go through this one. Okay. Passcode hint. None. This time we'll do this properly. Passcode too high. Access denied. Yep. We cut it in half then. Passcode too low. Access denied. Okay, so... Passcode accepted. Lock released. It was exactly 38. Well, that was convenient. Did you know that you can jack into any blackboard? Indeed. We got an HP memory! Awesome. More hit points is always good. Especially with how bad I've been playing. <laughs> Uh, you know what? I don't even need to use that. Uh... We're just gonna do that. Hmm. Okay, now, I can't actually hit you with a freaking shotgun. I might be able to hit you with a mini bomb, actually. Let's try that. 50%. Nope. Dodge to the wrong place. Oh well. Honestly, I think it was worth the shot. The try, rather. Ah, well, we got another cannon. Oh yeah, that's another one we're gonna get tons of. Cannons! But cannons are at least more useful than the Metar stuff. Number of doors in this school. Um... Hmm. Well, there's five on the top floor. So... Oh, hey, you guys are out here now. There's another... There's at least another five on this floor. Oh, no, that would be six, seven... Eight. Okay. So, five and eight is... Twelve. No, thirteen. I can... I can do basic math. Really. Oh, the children are scared, poor things. Something... Someone must do something, but I can't leave them. Well, they are first graders. Two of the guppies are floating. B oh, oh! Some kind of larvae are crawling inside. A class schedule. 
Really? Oh wait, only four classes. Are you sure it's not like kindergarten? Like, is the Japanese first grade the equivalent of kindergarten in ca Canada and the US, I suppose? The US... Yeah, no, it definitely does. Um, although there are probably some differences between the two. A anyway, I'm getting sidetracked. Okay, that one's locked. Um, wait a second. Wait a second. Still cannot stand up. Okay. Okay. Right, so I guess I'll just phone Mega Man back now. Tell him the answer is 13! Unless the double door counts as 2, but there's no way I could know that without trying. No? Okay, 14. Seriously? Does it not count the double door at all? Okay, what the hell? I know there's five on the top floor. This is another... That's nine. Oh, I forgot about the staircase. Okay. So, that would be 15. Okay then. Doesn't look like there's any items in here. Uh, anything back here? Maybe. There's Metaurus back here. <laughs> At least. That's something, I guess. Right, let's, uh, you know, I can get a double kill on you guys. Let's do that. Oh. Watch out for the ghost. Ha! Double kill! Now, I just need to kill the ghost. Um... Uh, it's a little bit iffy to hit it with wide sword. Eh, let's try it anyway, though. I think it'll be interesting. Just wait for it to disappear. Oh, like that. Oh, nope. Uh, that was a fail. Haha! Okay then. Oh hey, to backtrack on the conversation to last episode, uh, there's something I forgot to mention about the uh, Navi chips. We're always and without exception, they will always have a code that matches the first letter of their uh, name. So roll is always R, for example. Gutsman would be G, and so on and so forth. Uh, the only exception to that is they are coded by their Japanese names. So if the name doesn't match up, that's the reason. For instance, um, no, actually none of the navies we've seen thus far have different names in, ja in Japan. Uh, so I can't actually, well, so it's hard for me to mention it without spoilers, but if you think about Mega Man characters, I'm sure you can think of a couple robots who are called something different in Japanese. Uh, in any case, on that note, I'm going to stop up here. Join me next time when we probably get to the bottom of this. Yeah. Until then, this has been Let's Play Mega Man Battle Network with Kes Blue, and have a good day. Bye!